welcome back to my channel if you're new here I just want to say a warm welcome to you thank you for choosing to subscribe to my channel and I do hope that you will stick and stay if you're not so new here thank you for joining with me and please do continue to enjoy the journey let's do this together so guys today I will be doing a carrot cake from the um, carrot that I have left over from my juicing last week so yes I'll be making a cake with that so in my cup I have some trash which is about three cups of um, carrots and in my bowl there I have my dry ingredients which have already been sifted that includes the flour the salt the baking powder baking soda nutmeg cinnamon right that's basically it so those have all been sifted together I also have in a cup there three cups of sugar I also have some raisins and some ground pecans and in that bowl I have the eggs I'll be using some oil because this recipe requires oil and not butter however you can use butter if you choose to because I saw a recipe where the young man used both butter and oil to make his carrot cake however I'll just be using the oil to do mine okay so please enjoy this video guys I tell you it's something because sometimes the things don't go the way we want them to go however you will see the end result so watch me guys all right so I'm about to mix my eggs there yes and it's doing its thing mm-hmm I tell you actually I never necessarily had to mix um, use the mixer but guess what the, the sugar that I used it was very coarse one of those organic sugar they say so the grains were very coarse and um, I did not remember to to um, to powder it out in a bu bullet like I planned to because you know you can do that if you have coarse sugar or if you have some coarse salt like the Himalayan you know the coarse ones yes you can you know powder it out in a um, bullet or in a blender yeah to make it more refined yes so um, my blades were giving me trouble right there they weren't connected properly so I had to you know reconnect them and continue the process so there I'm whisking the eggs and um, eventually I started adding my sugar gradually which was supposed to be added gradually by the way but you will see so yes I'm still there whisking the eggs whisking 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 away mm-hmm yeah man girl thing, you know yes man so there I'm adding the sugar which was supposed to be added gradually but guess what the sugar decided to pour out because I was using a spoon you know because I had my hands occupied and stuff so yeah but I should have used a spoon so I'm there um combining the egg and the sugar get rid of those you know greens like I said those greens are very coarse yeah and by the way that's the um what sugar was it again oh I'm here telling you but I don't remember the, the brand sugar that's the one I buy and it says um, non GMO you know what what got me about that sugar it says vegan no you tell me why would they need to put it on a label that a sugar is vegan shouldn't all sugars be vegan doesn't it come from plants so please can someone ex someone explain to me why they have to you know specify that the sugar is actually vegan Hmm, this just has me thinking away guys because I've heard some horror stories which I won't even mention right now but that part got to me so guys I'm here continuing to um, you know cream the, the the sugar with the egg mix the sugar with the egg yes so it's getting a bit smoother there now yes 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 I was just checking to see you know how far along it was yeah so apparently I stopped there for a second uh -huh. oh at that point my oil was added hmm, how did I miss that 
So my oil was already added to the eggs and the sugar. So yeah, there you have it. The egg, the oil, and the sugar. Right, so I was just there draining my, um, my plates off to remove them so that I could actually add my dry ingredients to the mixture. So there it is draining. And by the way, guys, I'm kind of getting used to this voiceover thing, you know. <laughs> it's not so bad after all. You know, sometimes some, some things take some getting used to. So I guess that's how it is for me and the voicing over. I'm getting more comfortable with it. So guys, here the joke now. My pan was stuck to, um, to the bottom of the mixer right there. For some reason, it wasn't freeing up. But anyway, I managed to get it out. So now I'm adding my flour to my mixture. Yes, and I'm, I'll be doing this gradually. Yes, so I'm doing the right thing there by using the spatula to, um, you know, to pour in the flour. So I'm there folding in, uh, folding and um, mixing and folding rather. Yes, so I'm doing that at the moment. Mixing and folding. Yes, yes, yes. Want to get it right, you know, guys. <laughs> I want to get it right. And speaking of get it right, you will see. You will see for yourself. So I'm there mixing and folding. I'm, and, and now I'm going to add the rest of my flour. And boy, see I'm there wasting the flour and all. Oh boy. But anyway, such is life. Such is life. So I'm going to continue hmm, scraping out the rest of the floor. Mm, nothing now waste, nothing now dash way, no sir. Mm -mm. Mm -hmm. Alright, so I'm going to continue mixing and folding like my granny taught me. Yes, 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 doing my thing right there guys. Doing my thing, doing my thing. And by the way, guys, in case you're wondering about my trash, which was used from whenever it was refrigerated and it was still pre pretty fresh. So, yeah, it was safe to use. So now I'm adding my coconut, my grated coconut. Let me just say grated coconut. Right. And I am folding it in. There, there you go. I'm folding it in. And you know we add it gradually. So I'm going to add the rest of it. Mm -hmm. Getting it all out. Yes, yes. Mm -hmm. Yeah, girl, do your thing. So I'm there mixing and folding, mixing and folding, mixing and folding. Mixing and folding, mixing and folding my butter. I butter them call it? No, so they call it, yes. So I'm there mixing and folding, mixing and folding, mixing and folding. And here I'm trying to make a song. Adding my raisins there, yes. Trying to spruce it up a bit. Yeah, with some raisins, guys. Mm hmm Mixing and folding, mixing and folding, mixing and folding, mixing <laughs> mixin and folding, mixing and folding. Hey, there we go, there we go, there we go. Mixing and folding, mixing and folding. Mm hmm, mm hmm. Yes, Inga, do your thing. Mix, fold, mix and fold, just like a granny teacher. Who's we'll saying in there, learn? So now, guys, I'm adding my pecans. So I saw a recipe where they actually added um, nuts to it. So I said, let me, let me give it a try also. And guys, by the way, for this recipe, you don't necessarily have to use, um, no, sorry. For this recipe, you can actually use butter in it if you wish to. But I just used the oil because I saw another, where another YouTuber, he actually used um, butter and oil however i'm just using oil in mine by the way guys guess what happened now so in the midst of doing my voiceover right here 
my battery signal came on so yeah i actually had to stop and then you know continue so guys my mixture is done so there i have my pan which was um greased and lightly dusted with flour so now here's the joke part no no i'm adding <laughs> my mixture to the pan yeah guys yeah guys so i'm there trying to get that mixture out but guess what now mega give another joke the mixture was a bit too thick it was a bit too thick i kind of did my own thing but um i actually added a little just a tops of water a little water just a small amount so um can you see it can you see how thick it looks so there i was worried now you know i managed to get it in the pan but guess what i was worried i said you know what this ain't gonna go on youtube but when i'm doing the voiceover when i decided to do the voiceover i said you know what i'm not gonna hide anything because it's about fun you know so i'm gonna add all of the bloops and the blunders and all of that so yeah guys my, when i when i um pour the mixture in as a matter of fact it couldn't pour <laughs> Thank God I had the spatula so I could get it out. So it looked a bit bony. So I'm like, hmm, I wonder how this is going to come out. It's going to be like a bread or something. But you will see the result, guys. You will see. Just watch till the end. Please watch till the end. And please do not forward it, guys. Watch till the end. So there's my cake, guys. There's my cake. I tell you, there's my cake. At one point when I checked it, I tell you that middle was so soft, but eventually it got it got done. So you see, I got a good drop there, guys. I got a good drop. I got a good drop. I felt so good. So now I'm flipping it. Yeah, yeah, girl, yeah, girl. So there you have it, my carrot cake. That's a proud moment for me there, guys, because the cake that I never thought would have turned out good, it did turn out good indeed. And trust me, it did turn out good. You can take my word for it. If any, any of you were close to me, I would let you taste it. So you see, look at that. Look at that, guys. Look at that. And by the way, it was early in the morning because... I couldn't stay up to let it cool and all of that stuff. So there is my carrot cake. Yeah, guys. If you've made it this far in the video, guys, thank you so much for watching. I appreciate you all. Much love. Mwah. I'm out.